to study the reactions of sodium hydroxide with aluminium metal and hydrochloric acid. Materials required We will require dilute hydrochloric acid, sodium hydroxide solution, aluminium metal, blue litmus paper, red litmus paper, measuring cylinder, test tube, spatula, dropper, test tube holder, a lighted candle and a burner. Reaction with aluminium metal Procedure Take a small piece of aluminium metal using a spatula and put the aluminium metal to the test tube placed in the test tube stand. Take about 5 ml sodium hydroxide solution in a measuring cylinder and pour it into the test tube containing aluminium metal. Observe the effervescence and colorless gas coming out through the test tube mouth from the reaction mixture. Perform the smell test on the gas liberated by fanning the gas gently towards your nose. There will be no smell for the liberated gas. Then conduct a litmus test by bringing the moist blue and red litmus papers to the mouth of the test tube when gas is liberating. We observe that red litmus stays red itself. Then take blue litmus paper and we observe blue litmus stays blue. Add two pieces of aluminium metal to the next clean and dry test tube using a spatula. Take about 5 ml sodium hydroxide solution in a measuring cylinder and pour it into the test tube containing aluminium metal. Observe the effervescence and colorless gas coming out through the test tube mouth from the reaction mixture. Heat the test tube using a Bunsen burner and observe the effervescence and colorless gas coming out through the test tube mouth from the reaction mixture. Bring the lighted candle to the mouth of the test tube when the colorless gas is liberating. We observe that the hydrogen gas coming out of the test tube causes the flame to flare up and the mild explosion and popping sound of the flame dips out. Reaction with dilute hydrochloric acid We require a test tube and test tube stand, measuring cylinder, dilute hydrochloric acid, sodium hydroxide solution, blue litmus, red litmus and a dropper. Take 5 ml of dilute sodium hydroxide solution in measuring cylinder and pour it in the test tube in test tube stand. Then take a dropper and take 2 ml of the dilute hydrochloric acid in a measuring cylinder and pour it into the test tube containing sodium hydroxide solution. Shake the solution carefully. Then take a dropper and take 3 ml of the dilute hydrochloric acid in a measuring cylinder and pour it into the test tube containing sodium hydroxide solution. Then take red litmus paper and dip it into the test tube and see the color change. We observe no color change in the red litmus. Then take blue litmus paper and dip it into the test tube and see the color change. We observe no color change in the blue litmus. We observe no color change in the red litmus and blue litmus. 
because the pH value of the solution is 7 which is neutral. Then touch the test tube and feel the temperature. You will find it warm.